Breaking crypto news. BlackRock Bitcoin ETF names JP Morgan Jane Street as authorized participants. JP Morgan officially in the business of helping BlackRock sell Bitcoin does not get bigger than this. Bitcoin critic Jamie Dimon, JP Morgan to buy BTC on behalf of BlackRock's ETF. Right, so JP Morgan CEO criticized for Bitcoin ETF role and made anti crypto comments. So he's critical of it publicly, but then privately, they're just buying, building infrastructure to sell Bitcoin to the masses and to the institutions. Right, Wall Street investing deep. Bitcoin spy ETF wars. Bitwise S1 filing reveals $200 million seed beating BlackRock's $10 million. So they're going to invest and buy up $200 million worth of Bitcoin before the ETF even launches, right? So this is how scarce Bitcoin is becoming. Percentage balance on exchanges. So in May 20, 17% of Bitcoin was available on exchanges to purchase. Now only 11% and falling, right? So it's just gonna get scarcer and scarcer as all these ETFs start to launch. Now this is what's next for Bitcoin, obviously, if you're wondering how these bull and bear markets play out, right? Massive dips. This is the previous bull market. We had sequential 38%, 33%, 38% declines, right? So don't be surprised when these flash crashes happen. They're required to flush out the levered longs on the way up. So it will be very exciting as that all plays out, but these are the fundamentals of the space, right? Total value locked across DeFi protocols has surged to levels last seen before the collapse of FTX. So FTX couldn't put a dent long-term in the booming demand of DeFi, that revolutionary technology. Same with NFTs, back to life up 71% to $1.7 billion NFT sales volume last month, right? So this space is just booming.